You're sitting on your computer browsing a website that's all about digital painting. So what's with all this unplugged business anyway? Before we dig too deep into this series of basic drawing videos, it's important to understand the point of it all. In this video, I'm going to argue for the importance of a traditional drawing background and why, in the long run, this is going to be what helps you draw space marines and dragons. Drawing is your ability to both capture what you see and invent things that you've never seen. And once you've got a drawing in place, you can then use Photoshop to refine it and turn it into a painting. I want to go over the general flow of this Control Paint Unplugged. It's going to be a long running series, and it's going to begin by introducing the basic materials involved. Everything we're using here is going to be simple and cheap, putting an emphasis on repetition and practice. Simple homework. The next phase is going to get into observational drawing. The idea here is to look at something in front of you, or to look at something in a photo, and then draw it down on your paper. Being able to reproduce objects that you're looking at is hard to do, and it's necessary for the final phase, imagined objects. In all likelihood, this is what you've been looking forward to the most, inventing stuff. Drawing from your imagination leverages those observational drawing skills and allows you to visualize all those cool shapes that you've got in your head. Put them right down on your paper. Because the core of illustration and concept art is imagining a space, lighting, characters, and putting it all together into your own composition. As a result, this sort of imaginary drawing requires a mastery of those building blocks, the simple elements of observational drawing. So we'll work on those first. I'm not going to tell you that every step along this process is fun. It is hard work, sometimes boring work, and definitely a lot of work. But there's no alternative. If your goal is to make great digital paintings, then you need to master basic drawing first. I'm going to release these videos over the coming months mixed in with the regular control paint content. So sharpen those pencils and get ready to progress from basic materials to observational drawing, and ultimately into imagined drawing. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.